Today's video from sam 4 Help. we're going to demonstrate how to program a receipt footer message on the ER180U register. So if you've seen my previous video, I've shown you how to put a free line receipt header message in. So I'll just print that out actually. So in the last video we've gone through the receipt header, so we've put in business name, website and phone number. You can also have a message at the um, on the bottom or footer of the receipt um, and I'm going to demonstrate how to do that now. What would make things a hell of a lot easier for you if you have page 63 of the manual we're following that flow chart there so getting the information from page 63 but crucially you'll also need the character code chart because this will show you how to um, type in the characters. Okay so first of all we need to go to program mode so it's um, six mode takes you to p so p for program and then for the footer message we type in the code 750 then press subtotal and then for line one of the footer message we press one and then x time so everything we type in now is what's going to appear on the first line of the bottom of the receipt okay so if you've seen my previous video you're familiar that every letter uh, uppercase, lowercase, or piece of punctuation or number has a three digit code. So if I want to put SAM 4S help in again in capitals, the S, I'm using the capital S, so its code is 083. 083, and then capital A is 065, capital M is 077, SAM 4, so the number 4 is 052. S is 083, H for help, 072, E is 069, L 076, P 080. Again, as with the header message, once you've typed in your description for that line, you press subtotal to save it. You can feed the paper on a bit if you've got it in receipt mode and it will show you what you've typed in. So post amble line one SAM 4S help. So if that was wrong, if we'd made a mistake, we could go back into line one and edit it. It's ha we're happy with how it is though. So now we're going to do line two. So two X time. And on this line, we're going to put in the website. So we're using lowercase. So if you're looking at the chart there down the bottom, so I'm starting with three W's and then I'll need my dot. So zero, four, six. So the three W's in lowercase would be 119, 119, 119. To get the dot, it would be 046. And then SAM 4S help in lowercase. Lowercase S is 115. A is 097. M is 109. 4 is just the normal 4, 052. SAM 4S 115, lowercase h 104, E 101, L 105, no it's not, it's 108, P 112, and then we need another dot, so 046, dot co 099, 111.uk Okay, subtotal saves. Let's have a feed through and have a look. www.sam4shelp.co.uk So that's on there, fine. Line 3, 3, X time. So now what we type in will be on line three. I'll put in a phone number. So I'm actually doing exactly the same as I've got on the header message, but yeah, I'm just showing it's just for a demonstration, I guess. So T069 is E, L is 076, space 091. And then we'll put a dash in 045, then 091 for the space. And then the phone number 
zero five one zero five two oh one two three four we want another space zero nine one and then I don't want to give out a number someone's number by mistake so zero four eight 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 whack another one on why not um, subtotal saves it feed to check obviously you can, at this point if you're not happy you've typed something incorrect then you can go back in and edit the line if you are happy cash is the final button and then if we go back to reg pop in a sale we've now got a nice receipt header message and footer message which is a bit better than the standard just blank nothing on there um, you can obviously put whatever you want on your message you don't have to have your website and phone number you can have your VAT number you can have a returns message or an exchange message or a thank you for your customer it's entirely up to you you can have whatever you want as long as you follow the flow chart and use the character codes okay i hope that video has been helpful We've got plenty more showing you how to set up and use the er180s um, so some of those will be appearing on screen now so you're welcome to check those out you can also subscribe to this YouTube channel or visit samforshelp.co.uk for more. Thanks for watching.